Sagittarius and happy birthday. We're getting right into your December reading. Let's see what comes out. Can you guys believe 2023 is around the corner? We have the Death Card in reverse, the Ace of Pentacles in reverse, the Three of Pentacles in reverse, and the Five of Wands in reverse. So for the month of December, you're getting out of some form of conflict, whether that is love or in your work here. You're just tired of just going through the motions here. It's like enough is enough. For some of you, this was a permanent ending that is bringing you happiness. And again, it could be a job or a love situation. You're currently working on and focusing on yourself. As you can see, this woman is holding a candle, but she's looking behind her. So it's like you are you are always going to have your back and you're working on yourself, which is great, Sagittarius here. But in the meanwhile, someone is really feeling like they have made a wrong decision here or you feel like you made the wrong financial decision. You have not Sagittarius for the month of December. Things are going to line up in your favor. We have honeymoon. Enjoy the holiday time of bliss together. So you could be spending time with your partner or loved ones here. Uh, Christmas and New Year's as well. We also have worth waiting for and divine timing is at work in your love life. And then we have chemistry. There is a strong magnetic attraction here. So again, there's could be someone with Scorpio here or air sign. You're showing up in reverse where it's like, I'm tired of the conflict. I'm tired of the games. I'm tired of the delays. I'm tired of things not working out. And something has got to give here. You want a connection that's passionate, that has a lot of chemistry here. So that's why Spirit is saying for my single Sagittarius, divine timing is at work in your love life. This ending might feel completely um, at a loss right now, Sagittarius. But look at all this light. Look at all this happiness. Look at all the blessings that you are about to get, Sagittarius. So there's Scorpio energy with the Eight of Cups, Three of Pen... pen <laughs> The Eight of Pentacles in Reverse, the Three of Pentacles in Reverse. Um, be mindful of spending here, budget if you can, Sagittarius here. Um, you could be obsessive with overspending, you know, how we kind of block our feelings and we spend a lot. Be mindful of that, Sagittarius. There's a Capricorn that is obsessing over this ending. You could have Capricorn in your chart. Leo here with the sun, but in a will of fortune is here. So again, it's all in divine timing. That confusion, that clarity that you are lacking for the month of December is coming in. But you have to make that choice, Sagittarius, all right? Someone is feeling really confused about you. Yeah, there's the obsessive thoughts. Someone in this connection is gripped by obsessive thoughts. Time, um... Find time this month to play hard. We have find time to laugh, goof off, and enjoy each other. I know that says each other, but just enjoy time with family and friends this month and go slow, all right? Some of you will be meeting someone new. Go slow, take time to get to know each other. This is a divine connection here that is going to come in. So that's why, you know, Spirit is saying go slow. Don't obsess over it and just have fun, all right? Because things are lining up and working in your favor. Again, this could be around the holiday time that you meet someone. This could also be around the time that you are going to receive clarity from someone from your past. It could be a water sign here. Uh, we have the King of Cups in reverse, the Two of Wands in reverse, and Seven of Cups. You're going to be overwhelmed. Um, try to get in control of your emotions, Sagittarius, for um, this month, okay, for December. Um, you have to choose your path. And it's like you're just sitting here, right, waiting for this cloud to kind of remove itself and you want the universe to make a choice but you have to make that choice again someone is overwhelmed about you yeah so connection here we have your queen of cups with the king of cups showing up um, next to each other so this can work out but you have to decide you have to fill your cup up first before this person can even try to come in here that's why there's a delay all right because you can't approach someone if your cup is half empty exactly Someone, you're going to catch someone in a lie this month in December, Sagittarius. This could ultimately break your relationship here. Someone could have been lying about a family situation. Yeah, they're getting, they, are, they are getting their karma this month. If they put you in a third party, don't worry about this at all. You know, um, jokes is on them. They're going to be left out in the cold. Karma is going to bite them in the ass here. So we have I like you. Someone likes you. Romance is blooming. I'm flirting, wanting to date. Yeah, you have a secret admirer. After a major ending is happening, again, someone new is coming in fast. We have Coffin and Grim Reaper. Endings brings new beginnings, growth, change, liberation, transition. The relationship is over. No second chances. Grow and transform your life. And as you grow and transform your life, there's three of pentacles in the reverse here that you can see over here. 
it's going to start making changes. But you have to be able to have clarity, Sagittarius. What do you really want? Communicate with yourself. Because you're being, you're going to be so hard on yourself in the month of December here. It's time to clear that out. Whoever was dishonest for you. Whoever, whoever was dishonest to you is simply just not for you, all right? You have better that's coming. But again, Sagittarius, you have to fill your cup up for this divine connection to come in, right? So that's why, again, two of wands is going to first. Again, there is a delay. You have to be able to take that risk. Time to tap into your masculine energy more than your feminine energy right now uh, for the month of December. This could lead to a lot of blockages. And what I mean by masculine energy is create more stability and security for yourself. What makes you feel secure and comfort right now? Does it help you get stuck and out of this conflict and feeling lost over something that happened in your past? It's time to move forward. Because a situation can lead to marriage with the Hierophant here. We have Taurus and um, Cancer on the board. So you're showing up with your Queen of Swords in reverse. She's not wanting to be bothered. Know that a new start is trying to come in. But you have to release this past connection. And um, release like this pride and ego that you have. Right? It's not happening to you. It's happening for you here. And you have to be able to understand that, Sagittarius. All right? So great things are trying to come in here. Any other messages in regards to love that Sagittarius needs to know right now? You have secret admirer. Yeah, someone has deeper feelings for you than they are letting on. Yeah, and this could definitely be something that is long lasting. We have only time will tell. And wait, don't rush into it. Yes, allow nature to take its course. Exactly. We have you may not always understand why certain things happen. However, there is always a higher purpose to the events in your life, Sagittarius. Through turmoil, a blessing will soon be revealed okay so stay patient this month have fun don't take it so serious enjoy your birthday for some of you this is past person when they say yeah i'm living a lie i'm not happy but they're lost you know you can never go back to this heartbreak and this betrayal that they caused you here even though they have a hold on your heart they wish they chose you and they feel stupid so jokes is on them you're gonna get the last laugh all right i'm gonna leave it there sagittarius have a wonderful week